Hey, I'm Darius Psycho, and this is my first ever uh, video review for Focus on Metal. So, my reviews are going to be slightly different. I like fire, you like fire. We're going to burn something. Um, I'm going to be reviewing only CDs, like physical CDs that I purchase, which is, does not happen very often. I don't buy CDs often anymore. I buy digital music. But I do occasionally buy them, and I know there's a whole bunch of them on the horizon in the next few months that are coming out, and I'll be buying them. If for whatever reason I'm reviewing the new Soulfly Omen, I know it's not that new, but it's new to me. I guess it's about three months old now. Um, I haven't listened to this. I I'm bought this strictly on the faith in Max and in his last few, uh, both Soulfly and Cavalera Conspiracy albums. So I'm gonna burn this thing if it doesn't, if I don't like this. Okay. So Max, you owe me twenty bucks, dude. Uh, but if for, for whatever reason I happen to happen to like this album, I'm going to burn something anyway for your pleasure. I recently went through my bunch of crap in my basement and I found I guess this is a kitty litter box. I found a whole bunch of cassettes that my ex left behind when she fucked off a few years ago. Uh, I guess a decade ago now. So I didn't know what to do with these cassettes. Now I do. <laughs> If for whatever reason I like the new Soulfly or whatever album I happen to review, I'm going to be burning one of these cassettes, and they are—they're really like um, mostly glam shit or uh, movie soundtracks of terrible movies from the '80s, the kind of shit that she used to listen to. I have no mean, no, no use for this stuff, so I've got a lot of burning to do. All right, well, let's start off with the intro to the album. The river runs red. Snipe bomb in your head. The uh, hang on a second. Let's rewind that. Let's, sorry. Uh, let's start off with the intro to the album. The river runs red. Hmm. Well, that's a little odd, but very refreshing. There is no intro. <laughs> Bloodbath and Beyond. That starts off the album and... It uh, it grabs you where it's supposed to, and it, no unnecessary, needless BS intro. We're all kind of tired of. This is very classic Max Cavalera at his finest. I am skipping song number two for a reason. It is called Rise of the Fallen, and uh, it kind of reminds me of old Soulfly of the first three albums that I really didn't enjoy. It was it's too new metal. It's not a bad song, really. It's something you can really get into midway through. It gets really interesting. Um, Max Cavalera tapped uh, Greg Pucciato from uh, the Dillinger Escape Plan, and... Uh, Tommy Victor from Prong to help him out with vocals here, and that help was really, it's, I, it's, it's just to have some names on the, on the album, I don't know, I see no reason for them to appear here. What you are hearing is a song called Great Depression. Great Depression, in the French Empire is Not revolutionary, but it's just really, really solid. Now we are moving into track number six here. This one's called Jeffrey Dahmer. We all know who that is. I'm not sure if it's just me, but. Man, that guitar totally reminds me of Extreme Aggressions, the classic creator album. Listen up. Always cared about my bloody murders, he left behind. Jeffrey Dollar, Master Cannibal. Jeffrey Dollar, Master of the Gruesome. Jeffrey Dollar. Overall, this is. Just a great release from Max again. 
No big surprises, this is definitely thrash. There are a few nuances here and there. Um, yes, it's down-tuned, uh, but uh, you know what? If you've been a long-time Sepultura fan, especially from the Max days, particularly Beneath the Remains and Arise albums, I think you're going to really like where this one is headed. I like this one better than Conquer. Uh, once again, we do get um, you know the closing track here is the... Uh, of course, another Soulfly number. This is number seven, Soulfly number seven. Um, it being, of course, the seventh album. I really like this song. It's a, it's definitely not metal. It's a progressive uh, music of sorts, progressive rock. And you know what? It, what's funny about this song? It does not sound. It doesn't come across to me as a, uh, an instrumental song. It sounds like it should have had singing i'm glad it doesn't because it probably would have been ruined um once again you know what i'm not burning this album this is good release from soulfly i'm looking forward to more stuff from from max in the future all right max looks like you win definitely horns up to uh, new soul fly. So that means we're burning something. Ooh. Oh this is good. This is good. This band's called uh, trash. Trash and <laughs> look at the look at the title. This album is called Burning Rock. What an irony. Alright, well, I'm an environmentally friendly person, so I'm definitely not going to bring the, burn the case. But we will throw it up, though. Trash. Fuck these. Wow, these are just elaborate, man. What fucking label was this on? Nothing, no lyrics or anything. This is the original thing, though. All right, trash, burning rock. For focus on metal, I'm Dario Psycho.